Hello everybody, Sparky Combs bringing you uh, this week's yard sale, uh, flea market and garbage finds uh, for October 19th and 20th, 2013. Uh, I'm afraid this season's pretty much over. They wouldn't hardly anything out yesterday at all. Stopped at one yard sale. Um, flea market today, they wouldn't hardly anybody else up there. They were having uh, um, festival that's pretty popular around here about 50 or 60 miles away and some people may have been at that but uh i'm afraid this season's pretty much come to a close i next weekend the first of october or i'm sorry first of november they may be a few uh yard sales out but i'm thinking everything's pretty much closed up uh show you what i did buy here what i did find and then i'll show you a sales update for this week and uh Hopefully, uh, I'll be able to show you some more stuff in the future. So, let's see what I found. First of all, a Louisville pullover. Um, I know what you're thinking. Does people really like Louisville? Yeah, apparently they are. Some people in the world that likes Louisville. I don't know why you would. It's a size large. Pretty good shape. Um... It says Cardinals on the back. Paid $5 for it. Uh, Winchester um, knife. Pretty good knife in pretty good shape. Don't expect this to sell for much. I, I may get 10 out of it. Probably put it on for uh, buy it now for 13 or 14 plus free shipping or something. Uh, I paid five for that too. That was one of those purchases where I just hadn't bought anything. I had five dollars in my pocket and a guy offered to sell it for five dollars and I said sure I'll take it. So that, that's the only reason I bought that. If I sell it fine, if I don't I'll, I'll keep it. Pretty good little knife though. It's clean. Anyway. Uh, football helmet and uh, shoulder pads. I didn't really want the shoulder pads. If you look on there they're sort of old and uh, a little rusty and so forth. The helmet's actually in pretty good shape. It's got a few scuffs on it there. Adams, I don't know if that's a good brand or not. I've never bought a football helmet, but inside of it was super clean. Uh, don't look like it's ever been worn. Um, back of it's in good shape. Um, lady, I asked her how much she wanted for the helmet, and she said uh, all this together was $5, so I just took both of them. So, uh, sad to say, that's it for this week. Uh, like I said, the seasons I'm thinking is coming to a close. May have one or two more weekends, but probably just one. That is if it doesn't rain and or snow or sleet or whatever. So, uh, stand by for a uh, sales update. Had a pretty good sales week this week, so stand by. Hello everybody, Sparky Combs, uh, early Saturday morning uh, sales update. I've got to pack all this stuff up and try to send it out this morning. This is everything that sold this week. Um, got some offers pending on a couple things, but if they sell, I'll, I'll put them on another one or later. Uh, Beatles albums. Uh, a while back in one of my videos, I bought a bunch of... Uh, albums for twenty dollars these were three beatles albums that's in there that's rubber soul um i don't know what that one is uh i think that's hey jude hey judy 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 um that's uh abbey road i uh, paid twenty dollars for i don't know about 50 of them i'm gonna try to list a bunch more on there and those sold for $26, actually $29, uh, not including shipping. Um, so I, I should be able to make pretty good on what's left. Uh, the ones that don't sell, I'm going to take to uh, Lexington with me. There's a uh, half-priced books in Lexington that buys old albums and stuff, so I'll probably just take them down there and see what they'll give me for them. Uh, women's running shoes. Um, forget the name brand or the actual brand or type. 
pretty good shape running shoes sold for 23 um, Mustang 40th anniversary car emblem I don't know if I showed those on a video or not uh, I bought this one I bought a larger one that come off of a trunk and two smaller ones the two smaller ones I want to use for a car that I found a few videos about five or six videos back me and my son found in the garbage it's one of those little cars anyway it's a Mustang and I'm gonna try to put the emblems on that but this sold for twelve dollars I don't think I paid fifteen for all the other ones put together uh, Harley Davidson purse sold for twenty seven uh, paid five dollars for it the stuff that was in it if you remember uh, with some sunglasses and stuff in it ain't sold yet I've had a actually that's one of the pending offers is on the sunglasses I'm waiting to hear back from the guy but that's all that sold this week uh, not much but could have been worse um, paid five for the shoes by the way I think um, anyway only thing I bought last weekend I want to show you real quick I've got these on eBay right now a pair of jeans paid a dollar for these they're brand new the reason I bought them, the only reason I bought them, they're from Atrium. Paid one dollar for them. If you look at the price tag, I noticed the price tag was three hundred and forty-five dollars for these pair of jeans. And here it says Eastwood Crystal. I didn't know what that meant. I've looked them up and looked them up and looked them up. Um. But apparently, if you notice, there's another price tag right there that says $60, $59.99. I think, and if, then if you look at the size, the sizes are 36 I think the $345 price tag was from uh, overseas. I think these pants were in the store overseas somewhere, England or wherever. And I think the $60 is how much they cost here. But anyway, I only paid a dollar for them. I listed them in my store starting out at $20. I've not got any bids on them or anything yet, but we'll see what happens. So anyway, I've got to get all this packed up this morning and try to get it mailed out. Um, hopefully I'll be able to go out this morning and find some other things to show you. Uh, maybe sell a couple other things that, that I can put on there too. So thanks for watching. Hello everybody, Sparky Combs, uh, early Saturday morning uh, sales update. I've got to pack all this stuff up and try to send it out this morning. This is everything that sold this week. Um, got some offers pending on a couple things, but if they sell, I'll, I'll put them on another one or later. Uh, Beatles albums. Uh, a while back in one of my videos, I bought a bunch of... Uh, albums for twenty dollars these were three Beatles albums that's in there that's rubber soul um, I don't know what that one is uh, I think that's hey Jude hey Judy 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 um, that's uh, Abbey Road uh, I paid twenty dollars for I don't know about fifty of them I'm gonna try to list a bunch more on there and those sold for $26, actually $29, uh, not including shipping. Um, so I, I should be able to make pretty good on what's left. Uh, the ones that don't sell, I'm going to take to uh, Lexington with me. There's a uh, half-priced books in Lexington that buys old albums and stuff, so I'll probably just take them down there and see what they'll give me for them. Uh, women's running shoes. Um, forget the name brand or the actual brand or type. Pretty good shape running shoes. Sold for twenty-three. Um, Mustang fortieth anniversary car emblem. I don't know if I showed those on a video or not. Uh, I bought this one. I bought a larger one that come off of a trunk and two smaller ones the two smaller ones i want to use for a car that i found a few videos about five or six videos back me and my son found in the garbage it's one of those little cars anyway it's a mustang and i'm gonna to try to put the emblems on that but this sold for twelve dollars i don't 
I think I paid 15 for all the other ones put together. Uh, Harley Davidson purse sold for 27. Uh, paid five dollars for it. The stuff that was in it, if you remember, uh, with some sunglasses and stuff in it, ain't sold yet. I've had a, actually that's one of the pending offers is on the sunglasses. I'm waiting to hear back from the guy. But that's all that sold this week. Uh, not much, but could have been worse. Um, paid five for the shoes, by the way. I think. Um, anyway, only thing I bought last weekend, I want to show you real quick. I've got these on eBay right now. A pair of jeans. I paid a dollar for these. They're brand new. The reason I bought them, the only reason I bought them, they're from Atrium. Paid one dollar for them. If you look at the price tag, I noticed the price tag was three hundred and forty-five dollars for these pair of jeans. And here it says Eastwood Crystal. I didn't know what that meant. I've looked them up and looked them up and looked them up. Um, but apparently, if you notice, there's another price tag right there that says sixty dollars, $59.99. I think, and if then if you look at the size, the sizes are thirty six. I think the $345 price tag was from uh, overseas. I think these pants were in the store overseas somewhere, England or wherever. And I think the $60 is how much they cost here. But anyway, I only paid a dollar for them. I listed them in my store starting out at $20. I've not got any bids on them or anything yet, but we'll see what happens. So anyway, I've got to get all this packed up this morning and try to get it mailed out. Um, hopefully I'll be able to go out this morning and find some other things to show you uh maybe sell a couple other things that, that i can put on there too so thanks for watching